Hello everyone, welcome to day 2 of Capstone project series. I am super excited today. We are finally writing full code and pushing that code to the GitHub to complete your AI agent project. In day 1, we brainstorm our idea and we created our architecture. But today the real magic happens. Today is development day. This is the heart of your project. Today your idea becomes working a agent. So if you appreciate these efforts, smash that like button. Your support always gives me the motivation and more energy to create next video. All right, we'll go to the lab. If you remember in the last video, we executed the prompt one and we provided the our track. Once we provided, then it suggested five ideas under the track and we had taken the disaster relief information. Then we copied that entire disaster information and we included in the prompt two. Okay, we call. Then it is generated the complete architecture for our project. Okay, this is the prompt three, which we are going to execute. Before execute, let me explain what we have written. So here I am saying that get the architecture information from the prompt two. So you know it to copy paste everything. Make sure that you are running all the prompts in sequence. Now we are going to run this in the chat GPT. Very easy, right? Okay, here sometimes it will show like this. Then you have to write one simple prompt. Show the download file. This is how it is. Okay, just click on download. Save it. So now I selected the disaster. But you can select any of the project based on your interest. So now we are going to open the Colab. Colab is from the Google. What we are going to do, we are just click on this upload. Browse that file where we copied just select that see everything is uploaded here now before we are running this code don't forget to add your key how we are going to add the key click here manage keys google AI studio click on this project create new project to any project name you can give okay a is in demo this is our product once you create the project get api key click on create api key any name you can give okay just select your project give the exactly same google api key then whatever key which we just created right copy on this paste it here that's it we are done make sure that notebook access this close this now i want to show you the magic you can see that nothing is there here right once we run entire product will be generated nothing is there except sample data now we are going to run the whole project run all sometimes when you are running you might see these kind of issues how you are going to fix it then simply copy this copy that error and paste it here ask chat gpt what is that error give that error also copy paste here that's it it is exactly saying what is this it is saying that this is correct it is saying that worker.py copy this code go to the project just now i spoke to you right about this it is automatically generated worker.py this is the error okay and now one option delete completely paste it now once you run it you can notice that there is similar issue even in the evaluator also this is the file we fixed under the worker same issue is there in the evaluator also same thing you just copy paste to the chat gpt paste it like this and it is saying that the error is identical one option is this you copy paste or you can copy paste entire file when you're copy pasting you should be very careful so this is how you can fix your issues. Just be cool when you are doing that. You just copy the error. Just first tell that this step and copy the error. Just give to the chat GPT. That's it. That is how you have to fix it. Now I am asking diagram. Click on accept. Copy. Go here. Paste it. Guys, see full screen. You are understanding right? whatever user is giving user input is coming to the main agent once it is coming to the main agent it getting the session memory and it is clearly tell that what actually happening 
what are the tools which we are using a to a protocol you can notice that you have different agents are there main agent planner agent evaluator agent okay so this is how you can understand the code once you understand everything suppose you want to test your code go back here instead of this just say that this is the one test agent just simply now come back to chat gpt you just ask can you provide me couple of scenarios to test the agent expected output simple now we'll try this paste it here run this it is saying that move to higher ground immediately and call this is the number we'll try other you can notice that expected output matched here suppose you want to verify one more paste it see so this is how you can test your a agent taking the help of a tools easy right all right with this note we completed our coding and i want you to understand the whole code by using the help of gemini a and chat gpt okay let me explain this project structure one more time for better understanding so whatever you are seeing right run demo this is the one which we are running okay just now we ran right with the, all the test cases here actually once you ran it there are basically five agents are there this is the main agent and you can notice that all the other agents we defined it here okay main agent and under the evaluator we have one agent is there planner one agent is there worker you have two agents are there safety and helpline worker so total 5 okay you understood the agents now core how these agents are interacting with each other observability it maintains the session getting that information if you want to see it we hard coded since we are not using the any external api these are the requirements that's it try to understand the whole project and use the gemini ai to understand the structure flow this mermaid this is your best tool to understand the flow okay done now we'll see how we are going to push this code to the github first we'll see how to sign up to github make sure that you just connect to your gmail click here directly continue that's it your account is created so we can give some username username is available india create account that's it easy verification complete done guys we are ready with our github now uh, let's create new project get the description using chat gpt so you just say that can you give me the short description copy it paste it here create repository and now you have multiple options to upload the files let me take you into the setup in desktop this is easier way than writing some commands download now click on this download install it once you set up this it would be very easy from next time onwards click on this sign on github.com just make sure that continue authorize desktop verify email click here copy this code here confirm always hello that's fine finish see these are the projects which we have in my github just click on the project which we created clone it is under github disaster relief now simple now go to your project copy all we copied right make sure that you copied all now go to this path where is this path right click show in explorer nothing is there paste it 
now you can notice that these files are added here give some comment commit publish if you open this project wow just now added all the files done we pushed our code to the github i showed you how to sign up how to download everything i showed you just recap what we learned today we have written code using prompt we fixed a couple of issues running in colab and finally we uploaded to github today is where you are become a real a creator not just consumer in the upcoming final video we are going to deploy final documentation caption product submission demo preparation and we will wind up this series thank you for watching day 2 you are officially coding your a agent this is where skills transform into real project i will see you in the day 3 let's continue build something awesome thank you all